How you doing, people? Hope you guys had a good weekend. And I thank you guys for giving me you guys' time. I'm, I'm glad I could influence a few people or just even talk to you guys about some positivity stuff. Or about some positive remark. Um, yeah, I've been... I'm just going to let you guys know what's been going on. The weather's been kind of shh out here. And really shh out here. But we do need rain, but we don't need it all at once. You know what I mean? But that's the way it seems to be working in California. Sorry about that. And right now, if you look behind me, we got the cat right there on the, on the slide ready to go play, I guess. And then Pee Wee, she's around here somewhere. Pee Wee. And she's over there. And yeah, it gets kind of flooded back here. But we still got to do our exercise, people, no matter what happens. We always got to keep continuing to move on, no matter what the obstacles are in life. Whether it's the weather or it could be anything. Like right now, I'm off on my um, I'm on my downtime right now from, from physical therapy. So I'll probably be off for like three weeks to four weeks until the paperwork gets, goes through again. But I'm going to be doing, I'm going to try to get some good videos out to you guys. So today, what today's thing is, if you guys follow me to the end, and if you guys can, like, subscribe, and share my video with others, I appreciate that. And right now, I have this kind of resistant band, which is just a regular cheapy one, which are both yellow. And I got the other one that's over there, the one that I put always on the swing set. But I'm going to do a different workout with that one today. So we got the cat over there trying to do sort of thing. And Pee-wee's over here thinking she's going to go chase the cat because that's what dogs do. But anyways, so we're going to do different exercises today. But first things first, let's get to some stretching. Okay, people? Because it is cold out here. Pee-wee. I'm going to have to put Pee-wee inside. She's going to chase the cat and then she can get all muddy and then it's not going to get Pee-wee. Let's go. Sorry about that, people. So we're going to go back to get to the stretching, okay? Yes, it's moist outside, but you know what? We got to do what we got to do. So, hands, we're going to go to a, a toe touch to a squat, okay? I'm going to be careful, though, because my feet might slip out, so I got to be careful. And I am wearing my AFO brace and my knee brace. And they said another two weeks, which it should be like tomorrow, I should be getting my brace. I doubt it. They're, they're, I don't really. I would have recommended it, recommended them before, but I don't really recommend them anymore. Because my, like I told you, a while, like months back, that my brother got his um, toe amputated because he had a tumor or whatever. Well, he's going to the same place for like a, like some kind of special shoe that he has to wear for for that foot because of the way they kept coming up. Anyways, he's going to the same place and he's waiting on his stuff too. They just, keep, he seemed like they got a lot of excuses there, which I don't recommend that place. Not yet. We'll see what happens when I get my brace. And I have a feeling I'm not going to really like that brace, but I'm going to think positive because all these tools are supposed to help me. It's supposed to articulate at the ankle, which I'll be happy because I'll help me walk up walk upstairs because, or downstairs or walk up curves or down curves. Any kind of obstacle is going to help me to do better because I'm already feel like I'm past this AFO brace where I have my foot drop. And yes, my foot does drop still, but it's getting stronger because you're trying to trying to reteach your brain to do things. Anyway, it's, it's cool out here, people. I'm going to do this real quick. So, toe touch to a squat. One. Two. Three. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 
gin. And yes, I'm feel not a little bit windy, but when it gets cold, my plasticity kicks in a lot more. I'm sure it does with you guys. If you guys does happen with you guys, I'm sure it does. Leave in a comment down below what you guys fight with with the weather. I appreciate it. Yeah, this is my second take because the first thing I, did, I came out here, I forgot to bring out the resistant band. And because it is cold, when we're working, I have a stress ball. I'm going to be working on that to build my strength up. I start doing more wrist twist shit stuff. Sorry. And all these exercises I show you, you want to keep trying all over and over and over and over again. The reason I keep showing you guys things because everything meant for improvement. See, right now I can't do that. Because like I said, I didn't write a whole bunch of exercises. Sorry about that, people. And I have been eating better. For breakfast this morning, I already had a bowl of oatmeal. And then I had it on my protein shake, like I always do. So you want to get this right here. And pull away. I already did these. But for video's sake, for video reason. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You want to do as many, as many of those as you can, okay, people? And what we're also going to do right now, since we're here, I'm going to do some push-ups off the wall because I've been doing more of those as well. Because it helps to up my shoulder because I, I don't have, I'm not going to physical therapy. I do. I'm just going to go over everything I already did, but obviously I wasn't recording, right? I just, I cussed a lot on the video before this one. I do those just to loosen the shoulder because I get a lot of plasticity, especially because it's colder. And what you want to do right now, put your hand behind your back if you can't get it back there. And basically do the, I don't know, the shoulder shrugs, okay? Go up, throw them back and drop. Up, back and drop. And I showed you those before too, so do as many of those as you can. And we're gonna put our hands together. I, even though I don't need this anymore, but it's cold, so I want to work on my plasticity while I'm cold. Yes, I go straight with my hands now. So I'm gonna go circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Remember, you want to do as many things as you can, people. And since we got our hands together and praying for this gym, let's pray. Jesus, we look after me and my family. Look after my dog, Pew. Look after my friend, Veronica, out there in Arizona, and her dad. And look after everybody that watches my videos. Help us with our recovery and help us stay focused on what we need to do to get better. And guide us to, to better health. In Jesus' name, amen. Remember, people, I'm not trying to be religious on you guys. You guys do whatever you do. I do whatever I do. But we're going to go ahead and use the other resistant band. I don't know what it is, but when it's colder, it seems to get winded more. Okay, let's see where we're at. So basically what we usually do is these ones, okay? And then we do these ones. So right now we're gonna go cross. 
One, two, and one at a higher level, okay? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I am using the, the yellow one as well. I mean, this one's very light. This one's only like 10 pounds or 15 pounds, something like that. So you want to come across as best you can. Make sure you got this in the right angle. As I, I, I don't have it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. You want to do as many of those as you can, people. And what you want to do is do do some um, tricep push downs. Okay, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And now we can fix the same. Remember, people, you want to do as many as you can and as often as you can throughout the day. Because the more you're going to be doing, the more it's going to be effective for you to on your stroke recovery. I'm going to keep it short because it is getting cold, people. I appreciate you guys' time. If you guys can, like, subscribe, um, share my videos with others. I appreciate it. I, my channel is starting to grow. I appreciate I appreciate every, each and every one of you guys. I appreciate you guys leaving me a comment, showing me that I'm helping you out or just whatever. Just ain't even hiding me. It makes me feel good. Okay, I appreciate it. If you guys got some ideas like I should be doing, like it's been helping you, throw them back at me. I'm always watching videos to see what I can do to improve. What I'm really trying to do is just improve on my conversation with you guys and talking better. And I want to tell you guys as well, I've been using turmeric, turmeric or whatever, you know what it is, the Indian spice. I've been taking a lot of those and also been taking um, a bunch of other things. I don't want to recommend too many things because they might might not work for you, but the turmeric, turmeric, or turmeric, anyways, you know what I'm talking about, the Indian spice, that's been helping with my inflammation in my head and, and it helps out with all the inflammation. And also with also ginger it has ginger in it too it helps out as well it helps with your blood and all that stuff i don't want to get into it. do your own research do your own do, yeah do your own research and just find out for yourself do a little bit of research on what's working for them i read on it i tried i've been on it for like two months maybe three months i could feel the difference on it you guys probably could see my conversation or hear my conversation how much better it's working for me but anyways i'll leave you guys at that I thank you guys. Be safe. I'll see you guys on Friday. Okay? Today is Sunday.